Greetings everyone, welcome back to my World Baduk series, which is um, probably looking a little bit different than it has before. Uh, now, you might be wondering, what's with all of the things? Why, why is this all here? Well, good news, I am testing out a new uh, overlay just because I want to be able to do more with uh, some dead space that's in most of my videos. Uh, put a little bit more information out there, as it were, and this is the first thing I'm testing. If I don't like it, you never know this video existed, so it doesn't matter. If I do, cool, it's here to stay. Uh, as you can see right above my head here, I'm going to be trying to give some of these videos a bit of a theme, uh, not just a look at me crush this guy into the ground. I kind of want to work on a specific thing while I'm playing. That's the whole purpose of this UI. So I want to make sure that every video, everyone knows just by immediately opening up what that video is for. And as you can see here, I'll be able to write, you know, this game I was working on eating pizza really fast. Or, you know, whatever it was that I was trying to work on. And it will immediately uh, update and things like that. So whatever I decide to work on that game, it'll go above my head. Uh, the board will be appearing right over here momentarily. So yeah, this is our first test game. So that means you guys have a job to do. You have to tell me if you like this or if you do not like this. And fair warning, I would like you to know I have no background in graphics design. So don't be too anal. Thank you very much. But yes, if you like it, don't like it, do let me know. And let's get ourselves a game. Alright, 10.33, 10.33, going once, going twice. Okay, I don't know what you... Uh, odd or even, let's be even. I am white. So as you can see, there's my board, and I think there's a few things that I wanted to uh, do. If I was black, let's do something. If I was white, I was thinking about, let's go for shape. Um, And let's work on reduction. Those are the two things that I want today. I want some shape and I want some reduction. Let's just go for those two specific bits. We're not gonna go into like crazy fighty games. So into that end, let's give him something to actually work with. Let's give him a little bit of a framework maybe that we can uh, try and reduce. Um, he should approach me and then develop. Okay, yeah. I'll back off and let him get whatever he wants. Um, okay, he's going actually the modern style. He's going to be playing this rather than the, that. And, okay, okay. So there is a thing here, but we're not going to get ahead of ourselves. We're going to keep trying to uh, do whatever. But since this is low, this is territory. He's not really taking our bait. We could approach low on either side from the uh, outside and kind of encourage him to develop the left-hand side. But there's really no reason to do that. So instead, tell you what I'll do. Tell you what I'll do. I'm going to approach inside from here. He can pin me, and we'll change, and we'll change directions. I can approach high. I can re. I can reapproach high rather. Get ourselves something. We got a little bit of a pokey poke. Got a little, little bit of a pokey poke here, so we can do that. I think I like that as well. All right. Let's give him a basic thing to work with, I feel. Or do I want to just go in here? Hmm. 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 You know what? I don't think I want to Hane. I'm just going to go into the 3-3 three, three directly. So our idea setting off as white here was to go for shape and reduction. If those things are actually going to occur, I don't know. 
Which is why I'm not entirely certain if this box over my head is a good idea or not. Because it's not entirely up to me to, what, to decide what to work on in each game. So there's that. Um, I could go here, he'll go there, I can go here, he's still gonna go there. Um, I don't really see why not. Sure, why not? That gives us a thing there too. Alright, now that move, that move was interesting. He wants us to play down again and then he can like do things like this. Or maybe he'll just completely ignore me, I don't know. But I can go here instead and out a few and then do that. So we'll do that. I don't have to respond down. Do not have to respond down. It's not a good move. He's going to respond. I'm completely live in the corner now. And then we can simply play... Uh... Let's see, if I play the middle... Okay, we're doing shape. Doing shape. Let's just work on playing solid. Let's add that there, that too. So I'm going to play here, because I'm just going to try and play some solid moves. So that's what this game is. That's what this game is. It's not going to be a fighty game. We're just going to be all reduction, playing solid, things like that. There's one corner remaining. I don't feel like it's a good idea to approach it, though. I feel like... That star point's probably the better idea. If he gets that, he starts getting a whole lot of stuff there. So, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. But if I get this, he gets the... Okay, I guess something for him to reduce. Hmm. You know what? No, we're gonna approach. I think approaching's fine. I think approaching's fine. I think approaching will be okay. Large knight. Ooh, I don't agree with that one at all. I mean, the three three is available, but I don't want to actually give him the territory, right? The influence, rather, that I would be giving him if I take that move. So instead, I'm just gonna back off. But I'm gonna back off high and not low because I don't want him to keep me low. So let's go ahead and just do that. And itch my elbow. Okay. He's got that, I'll defend. He's keeping some territory for himself, so I get to extend out. Now I have a choice, Un uh, rather, again, unpredictably, I have this weird option here, where, uh, as you can see in that like upper corner, I can enlarge my area, or I can do the reduction thing. And I did say right here that I, was, I wanted to work on reducing. But I don't know if that actually works this game. Hmm. Almost makes you feel he's kind of watching me do this, watching me record this, and he's just intentionally trying to screw with everything that I wrote up there. Ah, uh, not very nice. Not very nice at all. But I want shape. My goal was to try to make some shape this game. So let's make this uh, stone and try and get some shape out of it. I feel like it's the exact wrong thing to do. I feel like it's the wrong thing to do. I don't like this idea. Because what is it going to do? It's going to give him something to invade and attack me with. It's I, I just can't do it. I can't, the game just does not allow for it. The game just literally does not allow for anything I wrote up there. Except for the solid play. We can try and play solid. So that's what we're going to do, I guess. Attaching is not solid. Or connecting, rather, isn't solid. Um... I don't have to play there again. But I will. I will. I will play here again. Okay, he's gonna do that. I will... 
If I jump out, he's got that, and I don't think that's a really good thing to give him. I think we're good. I think we're good. If he goes there, I'll just connect, and then, and then, yeah, we're good. So let's just work on building up that top. And I guess he will try to reduce us. That is the idea here. Okay, nice solid response. He can't do anything to us there anymore. He's trying to build up this area. We can see that we probably shouldn't go in any deeper than that. I don't want to defend this and just give him the rest of that as well. So I'm going to literally cap this move here. I can extend. And then I can jump out and make myself some shape. We can finally get ourselves some shape this game. Okay, nice and strong there. Uh, it's not very useful, so we'll poke at him. Okay, he's trying to attack us now. Okay, okay. So, without being too terribly aggressive, I'm thinking the following. This here is a small knight, and I would rather like to cut it. Um... I think we're going to uh, poke here, though. And he's going to be able to see what we're doing immediately. Threaten to go through. Defends the top because he can't keep jumping in. Uh, that doesn't matter so much, I can still cut through it. Now he's defended, but I'm fine. This is a large area here. So we can keep poking at his shape. Our area here is pretty strong, so we can't really do a lot. Uh, and now is this part that I'm liking. I can go here. And if he does that, I can do that, and that, I think. Uh, let's see what he responds to to this poke, because I need to know how he's going to defend. That lets me know where my shape points are, and his shape points are. Okay, he said that he doesn't have any shape points, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to disconnect him now. And by disconnecting him here, this is, uh, yeah. Okay, here we can see that if he Atari's me, I'm fine. If he Atari's me, I'm fine. So I'm going to completely enclose him, and thus the game has just ended, because he can't kill me. He has lost these stones, because he was not paying attention to that he was behind enemy lines, and... Yeah. Oh, that was very nice, but he's got five liberties, and he needs to live or kill me with those five liberties. I've got this and this. He can poke here, and it's irrelevant, because I'm going to make sure that anything and everything that tries to threaten the life of this group is okay. See? He's trying to kill me. All I have to do is not die. That's my only goal. Only goal. Just don't die. He's completely surrounded. He needs two eyes. This group is now alive. That is irrelevant, I think. I 
I guess I'll respond to that. I can't really see a reason not to. I think that's the right move. We're still alive here. This needs to be two eyes, which are never going to be. He's realizing that now he's trying to kill me. Okay. So this is, I think this is just a co-threat here, so I'm not going to play it. Gonna add a little note to my list there, what we're working on. <laughs> That's not getting killed. Okay, so he's got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten liberties or so. Um, I feel that I can go here and start poking at those liberties. Okay. So he did that. I can do this, get him, get rid of two liberties immediately. One, two, three, four, five, six. He's now got seven liberties. Okay. I've got one, two, three, four, five, and I'm connected down here. So let's just maintain my connection. Um, actually, you know what I want to kind of do? You know what I want to kind of do? I kind of want to go... He goes here, there, there, there. Hmm. All right, let's maximize my libs. And... Also go here. And now I can go in here. So we have a ton of liberties. Okay. Start countdown. So now that we know that we're pretty well going to completely kill him off in the middle because we've got almost infinite amounts of liberties, I can go and do little things like this that I feel are bad. So I'm only doing this because I'm thinking, can I actually cut him off here? And I don't think that's a good idea. It's really, really bad that I'm even entertaining that idea while I'm in a uh, life and death situation. So what I'll do instead... is go here and just begin the capture race. Okay. Guess I can play here. But we can see what I have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Ten yeah, seconds. I can respond to that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two, one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm ahead. So I can go out and connect on up. 
I can play here and connect on up. I can play here and connect on up. I can extend. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I think we can pretty well ignore his moves now. So the next largest thing I have in mind. Ah, uh, can I play here? Yeah, I think I want to go back and see if I can't keep that. Because this is obviously dead. We have about twice as many liberties as he does. Okay. Mm right. Again. One, two, three, four, five, six. He has not gained any more liberties. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We're fine on liberties, so let's just go and play here. Do you agree to count? No, I don't. And just like that, he resigns the game. All right, so this game we wanted to work on shape, we wanted to work on reducing, and we wanted to work on playing solid. That was a little bit more difficult than I thought it was going to be. Four reasons that you can see here. Board, of course, is flipped because on where I'm playing it tends to happen every once in a while. So we can see this. is pretty standard. Now, if he had played something a little bit different, right? If he had connected here and played for influence, then things would have played out a little bit differently because then I could have gone here, he could go ahead and take a very large point for himself, and now it's a, more of a question of playing solid and reducing. He decided to play the, uh, the more territorial method, so I wasn't really able to do that as well. All right, so we did that. Come on, ah, clear. Oh my god, what is it? Oh, it's quit, okay. Ah, oh, that always freaks me out. It's like, what? I don't know how to do it. Quit, no, I don't want to quit the game. But yeah, it was quit. All right, so we got that. I approached, he pincered, I changed directions, and I feel that's a weird decision on his part. Uh, I think if he's gonna play this way, maybe play this way instead i don't know if i play here he can atari and then go back and do a thing like this that that could be fine now he's got uh that influence going for him again which is what we were which is what we were hoping that he would in fact get and uh, we could just continue reducing him So we did that, and again we played here because we weren't interested in uh, playing more aggressive, we were playing more aggressive, then I might have done something a little bit more costly, or uh, risky rather, like say play here, because that lets him actually attack me, and then we get into a fight. So I might have explored that if that was our theme today. Might be next time, might be next time. This move is just wrong. Uh, it's hard to find a good move for him now. I think he has to play here, but then he's going to regret the fact that he left this open. So it's really, really hard to find a good move for him right now. Um, I guess he could go and try and play Cosmic Style and just completely build up and build up and build up in a manner such as this, but... <sighs> That's risky. That's risky, let me tell you. I mean, I, I like how brazen it is. I mean, it's kind of really, in a weird way, it's it's really easy to actually win with that style at, at certain levels. Because people would be like, well, I'm, I guess I'm just going to go here now, maybe make a small move, and then maybe that allows black to further just develop massively the start part of the board where you're just left wondering, oh my god, how the frack do I deal with that? And why doesn't everyone play this way? Because that's huge. 
Uh, so it's really, really easy to just accidentally give away the entire board when uh, something a little bit more cosmic is being played. But here, it's just not it. This is all territory. These, this move here is territory. Which this move doesn't say is this move isn't territory. Lord Knight is influence. This huge wall is influence. So I think this is where you really lost the game. I did this nice. I chickened out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I'm only human, okay? I'm only a five don. I'm not a professional. So I I wasn't confident enough to just give myself a position I thought may have been bad and just been like We'll, we'll do something cool here. I, I wasn't, I didn't feel that I could do that. So I chickened out and I'm like, let's, let's just build. Cause I've got, I've got this thing down here. So let's, let's just build up. All right, so here's me being chicken. Now I'm trying to reduce from these outer points. He's trying to save it. And you cannot play that, oh my God. I know he's trying to like not leave weaknesses behind, but for the love of God, you've got to come after this thing. If you're playing this style, this is what you were hoping for, so, you know, whatever. It, it's time to just rip out the kitchen sink and shuck it at me. Whatever you got. Come at this group as hard as you can. Make the most that you can out of it. This, the way he played, way too passive. Way too passive. This was his time to shine, man. He tries. He tried for a minute. Wasn't quite enough. Because once we... That. And then he's dead. So, it was a nice try. Nice try by him. Uh, I intend... I think... Uh, this game didn't go quite like I wanted. But I, I am kind of interested in your idea of... You know, this... This sort of style up here. So I think I will go ahead and upload it. I think I will go ahead and upload it. So do leave your uh, feedback. I'm kind of curious. Like I mentioned, this here, whoa, ignore that, sorry. Uh, this here is uh, going to be where I post what I'm working on, whether it's going to be something like uh, Fuseki or uh, fighting or influence or whatever that game. That way while that way it's just easier to reference what's going on in the game. You can look at a, a video, see we worked on that, and find out if it's good for you or not. If you don't like it, you can skip it, go to the next one. So I've realized I have like a hundred Fracking Go videos on my channel, so kind of hard to keep track of all of them and figure out what's what you want to actually see. So yeah, leave messages, leave me messages, I'm really curious, I'm really curious. In the meantime, thank you all for watching, and of course I will see you all next time. Take care, everyone.